Hello everyone, this is Direwolf20 and... Bahamar! Bahamar, how are you Bahamar? I'm good, I'm good. good. I'm very good. Um, I'm currently smashing some ore dust with a hammer. How are you? I'm uh, getting water. Sounds fun. Indeed, because Indeed. I have another adventure planned. Oh, why? Why do you do these things? The poor direwolf. Because I can't this take one, it. This, this one has cool stuff. And I think you are you sure? Along. Are you sure? What makes you think I would want to come along, aside from the fact that I said I want to come along? Well, there's this new waypoint in my map that says Nuke City. Nuke City? I don't want any part of that. But you like nukes. I like nukes. I don't like cities that are built on nukes, because I feel like... There would be explosions involved. Not that. Not well, that. let's just say that the city has already had its fair share of explosions. Oh. Have you been there already? I did. I did. I've done a little oh, okay. bit of lying around. Yeah. And uh, I think you're going to like this. The buildings that the nukes are in are so, so cool. But it but, would yeah. be dangerous. So, can I tell you why I'm hammering Orsan? Because I think it's good to know for both you and our viewers. You told me, but I won't spoil it. Okay, so um, you know the high oven that we have down there that triples ores? Yes. Uh, it only triples dust. It doesn't triple sand. So if you want to triple your resources, um, you definitely want to hit it with a hammer and break it down into dust version. Cool. Dust, dust, dust. Cool. That's what you want. Cool. Um, can I show you the awesome power system that I came up with before we go out adventuring? Yes. Because, because I you've, you've worked really hard on making this. Thing. I worked really hard on making this reactor. So right, where is it? Right, where is it? Uh, in my inventory. You haven't even been using it. No, I didn't hook it up yet. I was waiting until we were recording. I am ready. Ready. All right. Well, come upstairs. Okay. okay. And we're going to. Your little potion stand. Here. Yeah. Check it out. So the brewing stand here, uh, I made some different potions. Basically, the higher tier of potion gets you better power out of your potion generator. Okay. So I made some of these bad boys, which are Splash Potion of Swiftness 2, uh, which is basically uh, you start with Netherwort, which we're oh, growing. Oh. Right? Yeah. Did you put it in already? Yeah, you put it in already. Yeah. 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 Uh, so you start with Nether War, and then you add sugar, glowstone, and then gunpowder. So right now we're using gunpowder by itself with mob essence, and that gets us about 64,000 RF total per piece of gunpowder. So for one Nether War, one sugar, one glowstone, and one gunpowder, you get three of these potions. And each potion in total gets you, are you ready for this number? 256,000 RF. You timed that perfectly. I know, because I was watching. Um, so what that means is that you get about, you know, 750,000 RF, give or take. Um, why am I sweating so much? I just refilled my pack and I didn't really need to, I guess. Uh, so you get 750,000 RF per one of those things. That's well, probably because I'm standing right next to a generator. Yeah, generators equal heat. So Imagine you can that. see I'm like auto doing nether war. I'm auto doing sugar canes. Um, the only thing that's not automated from everything that we're getting is glowstone and gunpowder. But gunpowder we're getting from our mob farm and from sifting dust. And glowstone we get from sifting dust. And the other piece of good news about this is that you can replace the glowstone with redstone. And then you get, instead of the speed 2 potion, you just get the speed 1 potion that's a longer durability. And it's the same amount of power. So that's pretty cool, I think. Nice. Yeah. So I'm, uh, I'm a little bit proud of coming up with that nifty little mechanic. So I'm going to automate this via Steve's Factory Manager, but I'm going to do it off camera because um, uh, I think I've done a lot of Steve's Factory Manager on camera lately, and I'd, I'd rather not you know, do that on camera. I want to go adventuring in a city. So I think what I'll do is store this generator here. And remember, if you break generators, they do retain their power system. But all I really need to do is automate brewing stands with Steve's factory manager, which should not be hard because they're, you know, sided. The other really, really good thing about this Bahamar, by the way, so 
if you if you didn't know this one piece of information, you might be thinking to yourself, that sounds like an awful lot of water, right? Mm -hmm. um, the good news is that the potion generator only uses up the potion and it returns the water to you. So you get the water back. So oh, you nice. don't need oh, to, nice. yeah, you don't need to hook up to your auto water system. Like this is really easy to automate. Like you just pull the water bottle out of the potion generator after it's used the potion components. And I also think, but I'm not 100% sure, but I'm pretty sure that it won't, I have to test this, but I don't think it'll use the potion if it doesn't have anywhere to put the energy. So it's like automated in so many ways, it's crazy. Stop blowing up, Ahmar. So are we going on an adventure to a city that's crazy right now? Is that what you're telling me? Yeah, it has been untouched by man. It has been touched well, a lot by Well, it must have been mobs. touched by man at one point, because, like, unless the mobs built it. You don't know. I, I, don't, I don't know, but I mean, like, I can make a pretty strong assumption. Okay, it's probably been touched by man at some point. Yes. So we should bring food and weapons, is what you're telling me. I'm actually bringing armor. Are you? What kind of armor are you making? Just iron. Yeah. Did you want to set? Well, Did you want to set? Uh, sure. If you're making it, that's cool. I mean, I have an, a little bit of invar, but at this point in the game, for us, invar is a little bit um not easy to get because you can only get it from sand, not dust. So we're like at the point where we're making a lot of invar. Oh, and by the way, I, I've flushed out our machines, so we have an induction smelter, a magma crucible, a fluid transposer. The one downside of the potion generator, oh, thank you, sir, you're so kind, is um, the potion generator requires fluxed electron blend, and it also requires an enchantment table and a LX300 logic expansion card, which requires the LX100 plus two more printed circuit boards, three flux electrum ingots. Long story short, very hard to make. So it's not like the potion generator is easy to make, but once you get it, I think it's a really good option for power. Uh, so we should bring food, yeah? Yep, I got some fish sandwiches, some sandwich. cheeseburgers. I'm going to grab a couple chicken sandwiches, a couple cheeseburgers, uh, some toast. Now I do have like one turkey. or one apple with me. Oh, just in, in case, case of emergency? Does that give you regen? Is that how that works? Yep. Okay. Now, make sure you have your hang glider. Uh, I should probably leave some stuff here that I don't need. So I'm going to, like, put all this junk that I don't need on me. Do um, I'm probably going to need a shovel, things? Matic. Um, these blocks away. I'll leave a water bucket here. I don't need my watering can. Ooh, that's right. Ooh, that's right. Something right. else we need. I'll oh, even bring some buckets. Yeah. And we don't have any more elevators. Okay. Did you bring water? I have a second camel pack. You can make another oh, camel make another pack camel. with eight leather and an empty glass bottle. Yeah. And it takes up way less space. I guess. I feel like I just want to be super careful. How far away is the city? About half a kilometer. I don't know what that means. About 500 blocks. That sounds like a long way. Well, considering the other city is about 460 blocks. Alright, I guess it's not that far then. Oh, it's about to get to uh, nighttime. Why don't we sleep we... the night? Alright, we'll come back when it's night, when it's, you know, the next day and then we'll we'll be good. Sounds good. Okay, see you guys then. All the way to the top, or? All the way to the oh. top. Okay. All right, you're going to follow, follow my lead. Okay, guys, I'm here with Fahimar. He found the city. I don't know how, but he did. And we're going to follow him to wherever he goes. And I'm going to remember not to take off my hand glider. Hey, where'd you go? I realized oh, yeah. that I don't have anything for another uh, tower back. Oh, OK. So I um, do you want to bring a strong box or two? Strong boxes aren't very big in inventory, although they do They're not. with us. Yeah, you can pick them up. That's that's the, okay. the benefit. Yeah, you can grab, upgrade them, grab. but the resources to upgrade are not cheap for us at the moment. Okay, I got one for me and one for you. You have your wrench, or your hammer. I do. Hammer? Yeah. No, I don't. I thought I did, but I don't know where it is. So, sorry. Right. You have yours, right? That's all that counts. Yep. Okay. Ready?
Ready? Uh, can can we just double check our clones? Oh come right. on! I'm nervous. Fly with Fly. Me. Our clones are fine. Well, I did die last episode. I'm just gonna check it real quick. Oh, okay. Well, I'm gonna have to fly back then. Well, if I don't check my clone and it's not there, then, we then that means the end game of the season. Right. Yeah, I know. And I don't want to end the season. I don't think our viewers want us to end the season. Like, you should always just super double check. That's all I'm saying, guys. Like, even though like there's a 99% chance that my clone is fine. All right, you ready now? Ready now. You right, the one who was I'm waiting on you, buddy. Follow me. I'm flying. I can't see through my mouth. Should I be holding my... up or no? Uh, yeah, just hold up. You don't have to hold shift. Hold okay. Shift. Okay. I, I wish I could see you from see. my point of view, but my Minecon cape is in the way. <laughs> it's weird how that's what the hang glider attaches to. That is kind of funny. Oh, yeah, look, there's, there's the road. Okay, I see. So that yeah. wasn't too hard yeah. to find, I guess. You just kind of jumped off in a random direction and quickly identified a road. Well, the other one was south. And so I had to think that, you know, maybe it was west or north or something. So I managed so, to find the other yeah, one, too. The other one was subways, but this one was way cooler. Way so I cooler. thought we should come here first. Okay. All right, let's see. So first now off, uh, yeah. there's like this little mansion three-story place over here. Okay. That looks like a lot of chests. chests. Really? Plus, it's got these cool gardens. So how do we get down? Um, You can just right-click. And then right click again to. Yep, and then, you know, that'll slow your fall. So I'm going to come in on the second level. Okay, I'll come in on the third. Spawners. First. Yeah, break any spawners you see first, right? I hear yep. things. Yeah. Four Ender Pearls, uh, a Red Heart uh, Canister. I got a Red Heart Canister too, I'm equipping it. It's got some needle gun ammo for you. Nice. Oh, I'm hearing stuff too. Yeah. Yeah, right down there? I, I think that's all that's up here. I don't think there's Found much else. Spawn. Really. Nice. Take it out. 15 gold. Not bad. Okay, that's good. Uh, uh, downside is so that there's no real way to get back up high, so where are you? I went down. Anything down here? I don't know. I'm looking. There was a couple zombies that had me terrified. Pahmar's like, hey, let's go visit the city and die. Hey, at least we have armor this time. I guess. That totally makes us, you know, safe. There's some fantasy blocks from Chisel. All right, you want to go in that house? Yeah. This one will have some okay. players. Let's see. That was one spawner dead. Right, I'm going to go up to the second floor. Uh, rose red. Do we need rose red? Yeah, get that. Gun, I don't know if we gun. need it, but I could always use it. I got some more ammo for your needle gun. Nice. I should probably make you one. Found a monster spawner of Enderman, and that is the first thing I'm getting rid of. Uh, gold ingot and a cold water bottle. Ooh, two ender pearls and some more rose red. I'm going to check out a chisel. Red, red, beef jerky, beef jerky. Third floor, is that where you are? Yeah. I think it's pretty much it up here. So I'm going to start right. harvesting these elk. Yeah. Can I go down first? or? You don't need the elevator for that. Because you have a hang glider. Okay. Okay, you've got that one. All right, let's see. We want to go into the city now. Okay. You're the city guy, so I'm going to follow you, dude. Use this hop skip trick. See, I'm probably running faster than you. There's a zombie pigman right behind you. Got him. I have a gun. Have I'm a poisoned. Gun, you know. There's a spawner right here. I'm killing it. It's a creeper. I hear blazes. Got it. Got it, yep. Oh, factory building. Let's check that out. Okay. Oh, there. I can start to see the nuke buildings.
Oh, oh that is oh. cool looking. Hello, redstone energy cell. Hello, grab that. You have a wrench, I don't. Oh, wow, look at all these compressed iron ingots I want. Can I drop some stuff that you already have? There's a strong box. Okay, well, that's cool. I'm good for now. Rain plant seeds? I don't know for sure if I have that, but if you're going to open this up, I'm going to put things in it. Oh, I want that. Um, all right. Just let me see if there's anything else I need that I have. I'm going to put that ammo in there, unless you want that needle gun ammo. I'll uh, put it in there, because I can always just merge it into my inventory. I did. Oh, you're just spitting stuff out over there. There. It's junk. Do you want these assembly yep. I.O. units? Uh, I don't think we need them. I don't really think we need pressure chamber walls either at this point. We have a pretty decent pressure chamber. All right, do we, can we get to the second level of that? Oh, there's a blaze. I'm on fire. Don't die. I'm probably gonna die. Ender plant Ender seeds, plant. lightning plant lightning seeds, plant ocean, seeds plant ocean plant seeds. seeds. I'm dead. <laughs> oh, good job, man. Thank you. Do you want to come back when you're here? Yeah, I'm gonna make a new clone and I'll be right back. Okay, guys, we'll be right back. All right, guys, well, that was an adventure. Pahamar managed to survive out here, but me, not so much. By the time I made it back out here again, I died again. So, Pro Pahamar, did you need... Yeah, I made an extra hang glider to get back out here. Did you need it? No, I got one. Okay. Uh, any idea which of these buildings my corpse is in? Uh, I think this one here. Because there's one right, 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 here, right, here. right here, and there's another one right, right, right. right here. Yeah, I, I died many times on the way back. All right, that had an elevator block in it. And this one had... This is why I don't go to the city by MR. This one has all my stuff. Because you're not good at it? Mm, pretty much. Ooh. Ooh. Yeah. I'm not gonna pretend I'm good at it. I'm not good at it. It's true. Huh. Random discount. Random discount. There we go. Oh, really? Yeah, that was weird. Okay. Uh, so I am good now. Um, have you collected all the awesome loots that we have to be had in this area? I think so. Let's have so? a cheeseburger and let's head straight over to the, um, the uh, yeah. giant Nuki building. Okay. Did we go into that one with the little pillar already? Yeah, we did. Uh, that was where we found the um, robotic arms and stuff. How about this weird building over here? This has a weird thing on the roof. Oh, I kind of feel like anything with a weird thing on the roof is special. Yeah, that one has like the smeltery stuff in it. But it also oh, has stuff in there for a high oven. It's it also spawner. has nasty spawner stuff. Spawner's gone. Killing giant zombie pigmen who luckily can't get to me. Deep tank controller, seared bricks. I'll take the seared bricks. There's also some uh, scorched bricks. Giant zombie! Oh boy. That thing killed me in two hits wow. with iron wow. armor on. Did ow, you survive? Ow. Nope. Really? <laughs> <laughs> These cities, man. I'm telling you, dude. It's a good thing you had those potion generators. Yeah, seriously. Back when our clones are good. Yeah, I guess so. All right, Pahamar, for real this time, can we go home? Nope. Oh. I found more loots, man. I know. Pahamar is very excited about the loots that he found, but I'm very terrified of giant pig men who kill me in two hits with iron armor on. Or maybe one hit, I forget. In lots of hits. All right, are we going to that giant nuclear silo? Yeah, let's, place go there. let's go there. All right, so am I crazy for thinking that, like, as dangerous as it is out here, that there'll be more dangerous things in there? Well, yes. Especially because yes. I can already hear them. Oh, we're going in this way. Okay. Whoa, I'm not going near any of that stuff. Oh, here's a good sign where it just auto smelts the rock. 
Yeah, cobblestone auto gets smelted by pyrothium. That's a thing. Okay, let's see. let's see. So there is some reactor stuff here that I guess is probably good, but... Like, there's a lot of blazing pyrothium in there. Are we sure we want to be messing with that stuff? Are like... We? Are we? I... Watch out, out, fire, out, fire, 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 fire. Told you. Hold on. Ow. Creeper. Where did that thing come from now? Well... <laughs> Where did it even come from? That's what I want to know. Uh, All right. There's going to be a spawner around, around here. here. I'm going to see if I can sort this out while you get here. Get here. All, All right. right. Back in a minute, guys. Just keep her. Direwolf? Yes, sir, Bahamar. I'm scared. I am too. I just want my loot. Can we go home? I'm done. I'm done. I told you! Jeez. See? Pahamar does not blaze. Listen to Dire. And then it's just endless deaths. Oh boy. Distract that blaze and I'll get my thing. I'll try. I don't even know where it went. Found it! Yeah, it's flying. Baited it. Creeper, creeper, creeper. Where, 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 where? I got him. Do you have your gear? Yeah, I got my gear. I'm good. You can get you your gear take now. care take of that so I can go get my stuff? The blaze? I yeah, where's my yeah. gear? Oh, I have no oh, idea. Oh. My gear's up there. Up where? How'd you get up there? The elevator. That's a lot of dudes up there. Oh, I see the elevator now. All right, let's. I can get it another day. That block's not going anywhere. Okay, you sure? Like, did you have anything important on there? Like my everything, most of the loot. Most of the loot. Well, yeah. There's no. You sure you don't want to get that many mobs? Maybe if we go away and come back later, there'll be a few less. Well, yeah, that's one option. Yeah, let's go far enough away that they'll despawn. There's this other factory building that I think has some loot in it too. Because I noticed that there's okay. a second stack. Yeah? Where are you? I went out the doorway. Uh, Come back the way we came. This is the way we came? Yeah, that's what I'm oh, saying. Oh, there you that's are. Okay. Cause, uh, we hit this one because I recognize the two robot arms. Do you want a hang glider? Uh, Yeah, I will. Okay. Right behind you. Yeah, because I noticed this stuff in here. Oh, that's cool. This is actually something very nice. The kinetic compressor. Oh, what's it do? You have a, oh, you don't have a hammer on you. Um, it basically takes RF and makes pneumatic craft pressure. It's pretty oh, powerful. Nice. Yeah, we don't need any of this other stuff, though. Well, I grab some compressed iron, so we go power. back and... Uh, we go okay. back and... Let's see. Let's go... Yeah, this might be far enough away. Yeah. Okay, so There's I think this city. There's a giant zombie over there. Okay, so I think this city is scarier. Do you need water? I have a an extra camel pack. Yeah, but there's a zombie coming after you. It's alright. I can handle him. Take that zombie. Ow! He lit me on fire. Hold on, I have heat stroke, dude. I need to cool off. I heard zombie pigments. Cool. <laughs> okay, I'm on the outskirts. It's exceedingly hot here for some reason. Because you're wearing right behind armor. you. All oh, right. Oh, that's odd. Oh, that's a weird. Very. Well, okay. I'm cooling off now, so that's okay. good. Why so are we just we... going to walk home? Yeah, let's start walking home. Okay. Back in a bit. This is a like I guess we'll come back. Yeah. Like half a kilometer. It is. It's a long way. Zippy zip. What's up, Ahamar? You made it back? Yeah. I uh, We got back. 
And then I made another quick flight over there. I figured if I could get in and out real quick, I could get my gear. Yeah. They had the mobs despawned? Yeah, they had. So I had to be super quick, which is, like, I was too, I was honestly too scared to even record. I just thought, like, nice. if I try and do this and, like, try and set up a proper record of everything, Perfect. I'm just going to die yeah. again. So it was, like, so it was, like secret agent in and out. <laughs> nice. I, uh, I, I, while you were gone, I set up a potion generator um, to refill that redstone energy cell we've been using. I've been bouncing it back and forth between our stuff um, to make sure we kept our uh, cells charged. Did I tell you, though, um, what I did end up losing for good? What's that? That thief skeleton, the guy who stole it. Stole yeah. my pan. Yeah, I don't really? have that pan anymore. Oh, that stinks. Such a good pan. Dude, I told you it was a nasty, scary place. It was, but we did get some cool stuff. We have a lot of splash potions of harming. That's neat. Check it out, man. Oh, nice. You got the strong box back. That's good. Yeah, I got that back. But check it out. We got another redstone yeah. energy cell. That's energy huge. Cell, that's huge. Yeah, I like that. I'm actually going to go plug that into our generator and let it start soaking up some power. We also got some uh, potion plant seeds. Yeah. I don't know what they're for. They're for. Oh, that thing, it burns through those things quick, huh? Wow. I need to work on the automation system for the the brewing thing. Let's see. Where did I put those nether wart? And glowstone and gunpowder and sugar. I guess I lost my helmet, too. You lost your helmet, too? Help much. No, armor is surprisingly useless. I had more sugar around here somewhere. Anyway, I'm not considering myself done with that place. Well, you have fun going back. I will. I'll go back when I'm much more powerful. Yeah. <laughs> You, sir, are more than welcome to. I'm sticking around here where it's at least somewhat safe. Relatively. Even though I just heard an Enderman. I'm a little scared. Oh, don't be scared. Be dire. I'm... I am dire. That makes me scared of Enderman. Like, I think that's the definition of dire. Oh, dire. You're so dire -like. So dire -like. Ah, thank you. I appreciate it. All right, well, I'm going to make a few more potions here so we can keep getting our power that we need. Um, I think it's about time to wrap up, Potomar. Think? Yeah. I mean, that wasn't a bad adventure, and I, I definitely wouldn't mind having a big reactor. So if we got some of those reactor items that we found, that wouldn't be terrible. Yeah, but, but I can't imagine yeah, I can't getting imagine. that in our current gear level. Our level. No. Like, I don't even know what kind of armor options we have that... Like, I don't think there's really much in terms of armor that any of these mods offer. Let's see if Red Let's see if is Red Redstone Arsenal installed. It is, but it doesn't have armor. Yeah, I'm just thinking about weapons, though. Well, weapons, yeah, no problem, but armor, no. I can't think of any mods we have that really add much to armor. Yeah, we might just have to kill them from a, uh, a distance. Works for me. Oh, is that it? I thought we got a lot more. No, we really didn't get that much. Well, there was oh, a there compressor. Was I did get... iron. Yeah, kinetic compressor is kind of nice to have too. It does require a LRX 300. Better than nothing. In fact, that might even be. Actually, I, I might have lost my uh, quest book. You know, no, that's that in thing the strong we haven't looked at. Oh, it is? On the one on the right. On the one on the right. Oh, sweet. Um, kinetic Compressor might be in the Under Pressure list, but I think it's a crafting quest. Yeah, unfortunately we still have to craft it. That's terrible. Oh well, at least we have it for now. We can stop using charcoal for this thing. Um, yeah, it requires a little bit of advanced setup, though. Because, um... It generates more pressure than most machines can handle, so you have to build a restriction tube and do some other craziness uh, to restrict airflow. I, I've done it. It's not terrible, but just something to keep in mind. Okay. Well, 
Mm -hmm. A little bit of a little flood of on a that, flood. but uh, at least it was good for an exciting, exciting episode. Yeah, it was definitely a lot of running back and forth to the city, though. Well, I would be that totally cool with that vascular vascular exercise. I'm sure it is, but no thanks. Oh, okay. well. <laughs> I'll stay hiding in the base where it's relatively safe. Okay. <laughs> and we I did, will oh, build well, we did get those red heart canisters. We did. I got one extra health. Two, I guess, technically. All right. So time to wrap up, Omar? Yeah, I think so. All right, guys. So for now, we're going to wrap up the episode. We will be back next time. Um, I'm going to, between this episode and next, probably work on an automated system for power generator or such and such. Um, it should be, I'm not going to say easy to automate with Steve's Factory Manager, but relatively easy to automate with Steve's Factory Manager. Um, I'm going to make a system, I'm probably going to use a couple blaze rods to make more brewing stands. I want to have one brewing stand per potion type. Okay. Technically, okay. technically I could do it with each type. Maybe I'll do it with one brewing stand. That'll be a challenge for me. Shouldn't be too hard. Cool. Cool. I'm going to end this episode the same way I started it, hopefully. Logging in? Nope. Bashing or sand with a hammer. <laughs> you just keep doing that. I will gladly, because it's uh, something that we need. Pulverized nickel, we don't have much nickel ore, but we should have actually quite a bit now. Especially if this thing finished and is still hot. Nice. So, did you just move all our ores, our yep. metals? Yeah, we got 17, okay, 17 shiny ingots. Yeah. Um, I was more interested. Shiny ingots are nice, but I really wanted the nickel. How much it nickel did nickel. we get? Ferris? Oh, it depends on oh, how you look at it. Yeah. It's, if you look at it, it's ingot nickel. Do you see it? Uh, I see Ferris ingot. Or oh, dictionary yeah. Or dictionary. Get nickel. Yeah. We only got 17. I thought we would have had more than that. Eh, yeah, well. Could have sworn we should have had more than that. Like, maybe I'm wrong. Maybe I used a lot of the nickel that I had earlier. So uh, I guess that kind of makes sense. All right, guys. Wrapping up for real now. Daryl 20, Pahamar, signing off. Take it easy. See you later, guys.